Hey again, this is Tristan with Mindful Living Realty. Welcome back to Tristan and his whiteboard. Today we're going to continue on with our buyer series. We're on episode 5.2, hiring your agent. Number two, we'll get into this time more the more the legal aspects of it. Within South Dakota state law, it is required that we have you sign documents that officially hire us to work for you. Basically, some people in the past did wrong things and now we got forms to sign, that kind of thing. So there's three documents that we'll have you sign. The first one is just a disclosure. This one states the different ways that we as real estate agents can help you, the general public. And that becomes a seller's agent or a buyer's agent or a transactional brokerage. There are many different ways that we can help you. You're gonna sign that saying, yep, he explained that to me, no problem. The second piece of paper is an addendum that actually is an addendum to the uh, buyer's agency that we'll sign later on, which talks about in more detail the different types of agencies that are on the disclosure. The third type is the one that's the, the part that actually hires us to work for you, and that's the buyer's agreement. What this is, is this is a document that stipulates what you expect from us as realtors and what you, we expect from you as a buyer. We're asking that you work exclusively with us, pay us this recording, and actually, because you are the buyer, the nine times out of 10, the sellers pay, pays my fee. So you are not working for you, we're working for you for free, basically. All right? The other parts of it is, we ask that you tell us all the information that you know so we can help you. In return, you get our confidentiality that we're not gonna tell anybody else about you. Until this document is signed, you're just a customer according to South Dakota state law. We're not required to keep that information confidential. This binds us to you so that everything you tell us, we keep confidential, we keep to ourselves, so that we don't blur that to a seller on any kind of, in any kind of negotiation. We're working for you. And that document hires us to work for you, puts it all together, put the date, put the timeline in there, all that kind of stuff, so that we can help you to our fullest extent. Now, it's not really scary, it really isn't. I know paperwork always gets people a little antsy, but once you've chosen your agent and you've decided that's the person you're gonna deal with, signing a buyer's agency is the way to keep everybody protected, everybody happy, and it's a win on both sides. So that's what we got, not a problem. If you wanna talk with me about it some more, thanks so much again for watching. Have a great day, talk to you later. For more episode of Tristan and his whiteboard, all you gotta do is Subscribe. Also, you can check out us on Facebook, on Twitter, and of course the Instagram. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later.